Hello, my very most beautiful Capricorn. How is everyone? I hope you guys are all doing amazing. So my lovelies, we are going to be doing your January bonus reading. And this reading is going to be all about the person on your mind. So whoever you're thinking about, that's who this reading is intended for. Now it is still a general reading, so it may not be able to resonate for all of you. And guys, if you want something that is meant for your exact energy, I do have personals open. And everything that you guys will need to know, whether it's about this reading or about scheduling your personals, all of that is going to be in the description box below for you. So Archangels, Spirit Guides, and Ancestors, please deliver clear messages with a very clear understanding for my very most beautiful Capricorn, please. May the messages that need to be heard the very most please come through, and may they please find those who need to hear it. Please show me Capricorn's energy, a very clear message with a very clear understanding. All right, my lovelies, let's take a look and see what's going on for you. I am so attracted to you. I love that. I can't stop thinking about you. Ugh, someone's got it bad for you, Capricorn. Someone's got it bad. I can't stop thinking about you. I wish I could share my good news with you. And I feel you leaving me behind. Someone's missing you. Someone's really missing you. I hid who I really am from you and I regret lying to you. So it kind of feels like to me that, it almost feels like to me that this person hasn't told you how they feel. This person hasn't told you, um, you know, that they have feelings for you. They don't, you don't know how into you they are. Interesting. I definitely feel like this is either somebody that you work with, somebody that you're friends with, somebody that you guys, you kind of started up things with, but it never really got off the ground here. Okay. And maybe they couldn't step it up. Maybe they couldn't express themselves. We're going to have to grab the tarot and see what's going on here, but that's kind of what it feels like. Somebody couldn't express the, express will express themselves or step up when they needed to and you're kind of moving on um and they don't want you to show me what's going on in this person's headspace what is going on in this person's headspace their thoughts towards capricorn what's going on in this person's headspace their thoughts towards capricorn please eight of swords in the reverse kind of can't get you off their mind i feel like um they feel like you're not as you know, worried about them as you once were or as into them as you once were. The Three of Swords in the reverse, trying to accept things, okay? Um, that's also a card for forgiveness. I do feel like they do want your forgiveness, especially if they weren't honest with you about something and that kind of pushed you away. Um, and it, for some of you, I almost feel like it, maybe it wasn't an hour at live, but there's something that, you know, they kept from you that you wanted, that you would have wanted to know that they didn't tell you. Um, so for me, this is, could be them, them just want, you know, they could want your forgiveness or them trying to just accept the fact that you're already releasing them. Um, for some of you, it's a little bit of both. What's going on in this person's thoughts or this person's feelings? What's going on in their feelings, their heart space towards Capricorn? How do they feel about Capricorn? Page of Wands. So they do want to move forward with you. They're still really interested in you. They, they're very, very attracted to you. Um, and they want to take a step towards you. I feel like they don't know what step to take. Five of Wands in the reverse. Yeah, they want to they want to be able to work this out with you. Five of Wands in the reverse is a card of, you know, getting along, working together, cooperation. You know, that's, that's what they want. They want to be able to move past whatever happened here between the two of you. And they got the Page of Wands and the Five of Wands together. That makes the Six of Wands. So to me, I do feel like they want a victory here with you. They want, you know, they want this to work out. You know, they really want this. What are their true intentions towards Capricorn? What are their true intentions? The magician. So they're trying to manifest something here. Ace of Pentacles. They want them. This person does want something very solid, very stable with you. You know, they want to extend an offer to you. They're trying to manifest um, a new opportunity with you, like a brand new beginning. Sometimes the Pentacles can be just opportunity. You know, I feel like they're trying to manifest like a new shot with you, a second chance. What action is this person going to be taking towards Capricorn? What action will they be taking towards Capricorn? Any actions? The Wheel of Fortune in the reverse. Mm, three of Wands in the reverse. Queen of Cups in the reverse. They're keeping it all to themselves. Four of Swords. So some of you guys could have stopped talking to this person. Or some of you guys could have even blocked this person because of some kind of dishonesty here. Um, 
you know, that's definitely an energy for some of you. It doesn't have to be, but I feel like that is the case for some people out there. The Five of Pentacles and the Reverse, or Five of Pentacles, this person's feeling a little bit left out in the cold by you. The Four of Swords, um, some of you guys are just, you know, really pulled back your energy. You know, a, a lack of communication, maybe taking a break from this person, something like that here. Um, it didn't really go the way that you wanted it to, and you can't, you don't have the same, like, vision that you did at one point with this person, with that Knight of Cups being in the reverse. Um, they run a reunion, though, okay? Um, the Wheel of Fortune in the reverse, I don't really see them either trying to, like, take, I don't see them taking action, okay? Um, it kind of feels like to me that they, they either feel like it would be pointless or they're trying to, like, respect your feelings, respect your decision, respect your boundaries. Um, Three of Wands in the reverse can be a card of keeping something in. You know, the Three of Wands in the upper is a card of... Um, delegation a card of sending something out so in the reverse it can be a card of holding something in you know not you know keeping it to yourself and so the queen of cups in the reverse i feel like this person has a lot of emotions for you i feel like they're very emotional over the situation um, but they're keeping all of that within they're not really you know taking any action on it so this is kind of what i'm seeing you guys these are just weekly um you know little bonus readings about where your person's at right now but you know this is kind of what i'm seeing here so if this resonates let me know in the comments down below and if it doesn't check out your other sign placements sometimes your moon rising and venus can resonate more than your sun sign does if you like the way that i read please like share and subscribe and if you hit that notification bell then when we do our monthlies our mid monthlies our weeklies our bonuses you guys can be notified and you can go check them out um, but most importantly, if you want personal prayers for any reason at all, just put a little prayer emoji in the comments down below, and I will go through and pray for you. So I am sending you so much love and light. Until next time.